my favorite hot pot place in all of District 1, maybe in all of Saigon. It's pretty lit. There's lots of yo-yo-yos going on. They have a really nice uh, like seafood mix hot pot. A little win-win. <laughs> but it's very good. <laughs> so, uh, we got the termies. We're gonna get this over here, this flaming beef and cheese, never tried before, so. And we got the hot pot, and she'll probably order a few more other things. So, once the food gets here, though, I'll show you everything. Uh, I'll give it a Chris, Chris rating, Chris scale, the Strongbow girl over here. Um, I'll show you everything that is good here, essentially. Win ordered some sketchy looking shit. This is it. I, I, it doesn't look, it looks like tripe or, or, or belly. I don't know, let me try it. We'll, we'll see, YouTube. It's like, Tastes like a rubber band. Yeah. It's not good. Don't order this. What is it called? Yoju. Don't order yoju. Tastes like shit. It's good. Oh my god. You don't want to eat. You don't, you don't know how to eat. Say it. Okay. So. Okay. It's, in, it's intestine. But it's not good intestine. You can still taste the, the shit that's moved through the intestine. It's not good. Maybe a delicacy somewhere, but... I usually love intestine, too. This intestine, I do not love. So, not recommending this. Lady fingers mixed with beef and with cheese. This intestine, not good. Don't get the intestine. So after we get the beef, beef with cheese, we'll have a hot pot, traditional seafood hot pot. Bubble, bubble, bubble. Okay, so I'll report back once I try it and let you know how it is. English. Uh, uh, beef with cheese. Okay, now back camera on me. Okay. <laughs> Okay, so let, let's give an honest review. It's chewy, which, which uh, makes you think not as good, but then you get like a nice cheese finish at the end. I like it. So then they got okra, uh, ladyfinger in it. So let, let's try the okra. It's nice. So this is going to be a more like a Asian palate type of food. Like you've got to have have had a lot of Asian food and, and have a palate for, for Asian flavor, essentially. Would I recommend it? On a Chris scale, I give it a 7.5. So no. Oh, camera right. <laughs> like this. Come on. <laughs> Let's try. This is a piece of cheese here. So, nice big piece of cheese. Yeah. Okay, let, let's get into another piece. Yeah. Good look. Okay, so it's 7.5. So, after this. Look how hot pot goes. It goes to a boil and then you add in everything. You leave the beef for last. You put the seafood first and you let the seafood cook. Take uh, another five minutes for everything to cook. That's uh, the stuff at the top is fish ball. It's very delicious. Is this uh, Thai? So this would be, the flavoring for the broth is a Thai hot pot, which is very common here in uh, Saigon for a hot pot. <laughs> so we got the, we asked for mushroom and they said not have, but then I go, then I go, you not have any mushrooms?
mushroom and they say little one, but these are my favorite ones, so we're good to go. So the hot pot's gonna cook for... B-roll hot pot cooking. So we'll let it go for, for 30 more seconds to show you how, how the hot pot cooks. We got some termies though, yo! One, two, three, yo! So yo is cheers in, in, in Vietnamese. And you usually say one, two, three, then yo, especially when you have a large group. So that's the B-roll footage on the hot pot. So once it's cooked and, and, and I will try, I will, I will come back and show you how good it is. We're in the final stages of the hot pot. We've had the mushroom. The mushroom cooks quick within a minute or two. The fish balls are at the top. The prawns are nice and pink. Everything's good. We do the beef last, like I told you, and then we do the greens right now, too. Oh, uh, uh, oh, my. Oh, come on. Ah. Amai. So, Amai is like, yo, come here. Yo, get over here. Works very well. Yeah. So now the, the hot pot is going. Hold on. No, 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 no mind. We never use. <laughs> so you have an option to add a, a rice noodle. But never really add. The hot pot is so good on its own. Not need rice noodle. So, so I'll come back in, in a couple minutes when the vegetables and the mushroom are cooked and I'll show you how good it is. It's, it's delicious. Hopefully the lens... Oh, hold on. I have camera, camera woman. Wait a minute. Point, point down, not too, like, right? Yeah, training, training camera woman. <laughs> we get some mushroom, we get some fish ball. Oh, we got clam. Okay. Wait me, wait me. Wait me is what Asian girls say when they want to wait. <laughs> We'll, we'll try to clam first. Hot? Let's see how it is. Yeah. So the reason why I love this place is the seafood is actually fresh. That clam has no ocean or sea taste or fishy taste. It tastes exactly how it should, which you can't say for a lot of places in uh, Ho Chi Minh, unfortunately. And that was fucking delicious. So on a on a crisp scale, we're gonna go a 9.1 just on the clam, which is phenomenal. So let's try the the traditional Japanese mushroom. You gotta blow on it because we're not like the crabs. We're not trying to blow our mouth out. some squid in that bite too. Oh. So the hot pot, 9.1, 100% all day long. Absolutely amazing. The broth is nice spicy. You get these crunchy, I don't know what the, exactly this vegetable is, but maybe a cabbage of some sort, but. It's from the banana tree. The what? Banana tree. Banana tree. Wow. Wow. Okay. I did not know this, but very good. So this is a fish ball. A traditional fish ball in Vietnamese culture. Which is... I, I think it's chopped up fish formed into a ball. But... It's fucking delicious. It's so good. It's so good. And then you got a nice little tiger termy beer with you. Ah, oh, so 
Sugoi. Sugoi is really good in Japanese. Sugoi. Yeah, I use many different Asian terms. But look at the, the hot pot just boiling away. The prawns take a little bit longer, so if you're new to hot pot, the prawns take about 15, 20 minutes. They take a long time. If you pick them out too early, and they're a little mushy, and you get a weird eh, taste that you, you don't want. Uh, oh, oh, come on. So, so uh, hold on, I'll have her hold the camera while I add beef. Oh, you gotta remember the angles. Right here, yeah. Huh. It's wide angles, so and it gets me putting. You know. so now we're gonna dump the beef in. The beef always comes last, like I told you. Because it cooks very fast. The beef takes less than uh, a minute to cook. The beef, watch, she's gonna, we'll, we'll have her take a piece out. That's one piece she's got, already done. No, 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 you. Give a scale, a rating. No rookie scales here. Come on, try the beef. Remember, it, it's, it's nine, it's eight, 8.3, 9.0. Another outlandish rookie score, but it is pretty good. So, so let me let me do a review on it. Let me see what let me see what I give it on, on a scale here. Okay, we got a nice little succulent piece of beef. I give it an eight point nine. Not a rookie score. Oh my. So let's try another piece just to make sure that wasn't a, a freak accident. 8.9. 8.9. Very good. So when I cut back in, I'll get to the prawns. Because we're just going to demolish the mushrooms and all the other things we put in right now. And it's hard to record as we're both trying to eat. So I'll be back. My tip on the hot pot, you don't want to wear white. Like, wait, look, we're down here. We're down in shirt. We're, we're, I'll, I'll clean it when I get home, and I'll probably wear it again, but that's a forever stain. Yeah, we're, we're, we're down here. We're not winning. Don't wear white. Probably wear black to the hot pot. Or red, or not white. I see my friend over here at Process, same problem. But. <laughs> Any good team that fights the Patriots in the Super Bowl, the shirt has lost the war. We've got one here, we've got one here, we've got one here. I don't think this white shirt's gonna be recoverable. We've lost, as far as shirts go. Don't wear a white shirt when you come and have hot pot. My final, final rule on not wearing white to have hot pot, don't do it. My favorite thing in hot pot is squid, so we got, spoon it up. Yeah, we got some extra squiddy squids. They take about 15 minutes to cook in the hot pot. You can't go quick on the squid. So, we got a bunch of squids going in. We got the shrimps. So she's gonna, well, we, they call them prawns here, but same thing, right there. So, I'll, I'll cut back in 15 when the sh uh, squid, squid, squid's ready. I fucking love this place. I highly recommend it. If you're in Beauvain or if you're in District 1, this is the place to come to. The staff here is fucking amazing. You ask for something, it comes 10 seconds later. Like, the ambiance is amazing. We got drunk guys everywhere, drunk people. Nice lady, nice staff here. Like it's it's yo 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 central, which is cheers, cheers, cheers. So there's no reason not to come here. This is probably one of my most highly recommended restaurants. You will have a fucking blast the entire night you're here. You'll feel like Tom Brady winning the Super Bowl every year. Yeah, that's all I gotta say right now. Okay, so I'm getting more and more drunker as this video goes, which probably makes things go better, but we peeled the shrimp and de-headed it. Let's give it a shot. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Uh-huh. 
Yeah. That's the right stuff. So this is a, a nice, uh, juicy, big piece of the squid. Let's see where that's at. Oh. Oh. Oh, yeah. Come on. Bang, 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 bang. The bang is, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Mm. Oh, yeah. Mm. So good, so good. Yeah. Look at that. Oh, look at that. We're 15 minutes into the boil of the squid. Okay, put it put in your bowl and try a piece. Let's get a, a winning rating for the squid. I'm gonna go a 9.1 on the squid because it's fucking delicious. Let's see what she says. Come on, win win. Get it in there. No rookie score. Okay, so we're matching. She's still at rookie score. She does the, the whole numbers. She doesn't understand the 9 1, 9 2, 9 3, or 8 1, or 8 3, or 8 4. It's okay. She'll get there. But we're full of the squid now. I mean, it, it's, it's, it's delicioso. If, if, if you've had calamari, it just blows it away. So finally, we finish. That's what squid looks like when you get it right. Oh, yeah. We got a little piece of beef here. Huh. So it's cash out. We've hit the hot pot for the last hour. We've had many vegetables. We've had shrimps. We've had prawns. We've had clams. We've had squids. We've done it all. We've literally conquered all of Vietnamese's seafood. Oh. I can't recommend enough Say the name of the place. Loud. Thank you. <laughs> I don't have we a just clue. Try it. I don't have a clue what the fuck she said either, but yeah, try this place. Signing off. Amazing restaurant. 9.0 experience. If you like hot pot or if you've never had, try it here.